Hello all, in today's video I have another Looney Bazaar haul I just wanted to share with you all. So the Looney Bazaar, I don't know if there's other locations, but the one I went to is just east of Kipling and the Queensway here in Etobicoke. And I think it's important to support our local dollar stores. So maybe you have similar items in one of your local dollar discount stores. So I'll share with you what we picked up this time. So this first item here is paper plates. They were $2, and they have this beautiful scene of a cornucopia with lots of fruits and vegetables on it. There is eight in the package. Doesn't show me... Oh, there it is. There. They are nine inch in diameter. So I'm planning on using these and the other ones that I got from the Absolute Dollar and cutting these into puzzle pieces for... A November activity for the American Thanksgiving as little puzzle pieces and then my son can put them back together so that's the first item this next item here is just a large platter plate it's for Halloween it's got little vampire Frankenstein a jack-o-lantern and a witch a nice orange color and this item was only a dollar so just you know fun little plate that we can eat our treats off of during Halloween. Some kitchen tools next. So this first item here my son actually grabbed, but this was $2.50 and these are four magnetic clips. These are great for fine motor activities. Plus um, these ones are magnets, so I'll be probably using these most likely on my fridge to hang up like his artwork and stuff. I found this item for $3.50, so this is measuring spoons, and they are made out of bamboo. So just four different size measuring spoons. I'm going to be letting my son use these in his dramatic play or for doing an activity that requires measuring, and I'm just going to keep them over in his little kitchen area. And then I picked him up a smaller tong set because when I was setting up the activity for him to do like pretend play to serve a Thanksgiving dinner he was having trouble with the larger tongs so I just got him a smaller pair and they have a green tip at the end so $1.50 this item was $3 and this is a chi shaped roller so it's just a wooden roller and uh just be giving this for him to use with his play-doh play and different activities you can also glue little items on here and use it as a, like a little stamper roller like tie some ribbon on here or different elastics and then roll it in paint and use it that way as well or if you're just uh, doing like pizza dough and that would be great as well Recently, I've taken a great liking to the caramel dip that comes from Pizza Pizza. You can order it by itself or you can have it with their, they have these like sugary fries that you can dip it in. But um, I just like the dip and I like it, dipping it with apple slices. So I finally grabbed one of these um, apple slicers. So it's $2 and it's just one of those round things you put on top of the apple. It cores the apple for you and then gives you nice equally sized uh, slices of apple just fast way to do it and I think this will probably work with other fruits too probably oranges maybe even cucumber I have to try it with a couple of different things these fun little items here were a dollar each a pack you get eight in each package and they're just fun little Halloween picks that you would use probably to decorate your cupcakes or the cakes. So in the package you get a little bat. There is a jack-o'-lantern and then there's like the spider one. So I'll be using these with Nathaniel as part of a sorting activity. And then these last two items kind of go hand in hand. Now, I don't understand what's going on again. I guess it's because of the whole virus, but... Every store that I've been to or my mom does not seem to have white paper towels. So they've been out of stock at Dollarama, Walmart, and no frills and shoppers that we've been to. So I grabbed just this package of simple um, napkins. You do get 100 
in the package and they're $1.50. And uh, I prefer paper towels just for cleaning up his like little messes. It's much faster. Um, I do use a lot of just old uh, ripped up paper, uh, regular towels too. But sometimes it's handy to have paper towels. But the reason I got these ones in particular is I also got this package. They were um, $2 and there's six of these little ping pong balls. But they have little jack-o'-lantern faces on it. So what we're going to be doing is... Taking these with a little rubber band, putting these inside the napkins, and then making little ghost tossers out of them. So when I do that, I'll um, show you what it looks like, and I'll probably upload a picture on our Facebook page. But yeah, we're just going to make little ghost-shaped uh, like bean tossers, kind of, and then uh, toss them in our bean bag toss. Anyways, thanks a lot for watching this video from my haul from the Looney Bazaar, and I'll talk to you in my next one. Take care. Bye.